Welcome to the Windows and Computer channel and uh, I get a lot of uh, requests of information about different versions of Windows in general. Uh, one that I haven't talked about for a little while and we have a bit more information on is Windows 10 Cloud. A lot of you have been asking what is actually Windows 10 Cloud and will that be something that you know users at home will have access to or not. So Windows 10 Cloud once again is a um, virtual Windows that is running in Azure on the Microsoft platforms. And basically it's a way to get access to your PC. So the way that they're actually trying to uh, sell this, first of all, is for mostly for enterprise users. And what they plan to do with this is that if you have a regular Windows PC, you do a lot of stuff and need to have access to your programs or your, um, you know, your workspace, uh, that will be kind of a link to that. So it's going to be a virtual PC, but that will have the capabilities of having you continue the work you have on a own PC, for example, or on a work PC, a uh, work environment PC. So it is, of course, Azure driven, which is Microsoft's cloud platform. And it is near completion because uh, rumors are that the first real tests will be done in March or April. So this is this month or next month. And Windows 10 Cloud will actually not need Windows to work. It is a virtual environment that can technically run on pretty much uh, any platform as long as it has the required minimum and, of course, a good internet connection to follow. One of the things that they also want to do is, of course, we know that Windows 10 X is going to be released soon. And Windows 10 X, uh, Win32 capabilities are not there for this year. They will be there next year. But they are planning on matching the Windows 10 Cloud offering with Windows 10 X, which means anybody that would use Windows 10 X would technically have the possibility if they uh, subscribe to such a service to have access to the Windows 10 Cloud service on it, which means you would virtually in the cloud run your apps, your Win32 apps that was Windows 10 X itself cannot run. So it's really for a very specific kind of user. It is positioned by Microsoft as a virtual Windows that is a virtual desktop environment that is for enterprise mostly <clears throat> and enable anybody anywhere as long as you have a internet connection of connecting to a machine that would let you continue working on some of your own documents and of course do your everyday tasks uh, for work. So this, in the next few weeks, is supposed to be out, and we're probably going to see a little more and see examples of this as it comes clearer. And that will, of course, be something we will show uh, for sure, because uh, it's going to be interesting to see a few examples as soon as we get a little more in here. So this is pretty much out in the next couple of months, in the next month or two. As Windows 10 X, I think they're trying to match it both together so that uh, there's a possibility of of having Windows 10 X, um, you know, manage a cloud virtual desktop. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching our videos on the channel.